The Melliston fire screen design is this wonderful asymmetric design that came from Melliston House in the Scottish Borders. And it's one of my favourite places to go. And the Countess of Haddington very kindly allowed me to make this kit. And of course, we contribute back towards the castle for the agreed use of it. So in the kit, you get the printed linen and all the step-by-step -step instructions to make it. The associated kits with this larger one is the Melliston Stag and the Melliston Parrots. So you might want to work your way up from the Stag to the Parrots and then make the fire screen because by the time you've done those, you will be an expert. But it is quite a large piece and we leave the selvage, if there's a waste piece of material at the bottom of a design, we just leave it on so that your upholster has even more to work with if you actually make it into a fire screen. But I think the, the parts that are particularly attractive to me are the stag, the squirrel and the two parrots. But they need the backdrop of this soft shading and repetitive stitching to really showcase those creatures in the landscape. So if I open the walls, <coughs> Georgie will kill me for <laughs> making such a mess of this. <laughs> but and just take out the walls. You can see that these are rather arts and crafts colours. They are soft browns, soft blues, soft yellows, just a slightly faded version of the Jacobean colours. So the long and short shading on the leaves is actually quite easy to do because you start on an easy area and work your way through. The acorns and the oak leaves are divided shapes, so on those you just start in the middle of each shape and work to one side and then the other. The parrots are really worked last of all, and by the time you get to the parrots, you're very comfortable with the soft shading and you can see the effect and how deeply you need to come up through each colour. Thank you.